Top 10 Craziest Mistakes of All Time Made by Goalkeepers in Final Matches The goalkeeper position is the most uncalled for in football, as goalies can do everything competently and be the most incredible on the planet sooner or later. However more often than not when they commit a solitary error, that is the best end for some of them. This happens a ton and it will keep on working out, however there are a few missteps more terrible than other. It's not a similar neglecting to discover a ball during the first match day of the period than in the last of a competition. These blunders have cost groups titles, in some cases against rivals that didn't look hazardous on paper yet exploited explicit mix-ups that acquired goalies a great deal of disdain. We have seen a lot of these cases since forever ago, yet some of them have been more essential than other. Here are the 10 most terrible goalkeepers' mistakes in definition game. 10. Tony vs. Espanol, 2000 Copa del Rey Toward the start of the thousand years, two groups from Catalonia and Madrid conflicted in the Copa del Rey last. Atletico and Espanol arrived in Valencia's arena, Mestala, to play an exceptionally engaging match. Things began pretty well after Atletico's goalie, Tony, featured one of the most humiliating crossroads throughout the entire existence of the opposition. After he had effectively stopped across the goalkeeper was prepared to pass the ball to his colleagues. Little did he realize that Raul Tamudo was on the chase, he took the ball from Tony and scored an early objective that had the effect in the ultimate result of the game. Es Espanyol wound up dominating the match by 2-1 and that objective assumed a significant part. 9. Oscar Cordoba vs. Waterway Plate, 1996 Copa Libertador Ten years following their first experience, River Plate and America de Cali met in the Copa Libertadores at last, with the Colombian side hoping to seek retribution on the Argentinians, sadly coming up short at it. America dominated the match by 1-0 and they seemed to have a decent opportunity to win the competition for the last time, yet things didn't go well. Colombian side legend Oscar Cordoba had unfortunate interest in the second leg that assisted River Plate with getting the win and the title. The series was tied after Hernan Crespo's objective at the sixth moment of the experience when Cordoba passed on his area to clear the ball with his left leg, rather than sending the ball to the stands, he passed it to River's Escudero, who then passed the ball to Crespo and the last option made River South American champions in the game. 8. Oliver Kahn vs. Brazil, 2002 FIFA World Cup Not even the best are absolved of committing errors, we previously saw Oscar Cordoba costing a title to his group and presently is the turn of German legend Oliver Kahn. Back in 2002, Kahn was the best goalkeeper on the planet, showing the very best of his game each and every game, for example, Der Titan assumed a gigantic part in the World Cup as he figured out how to take more time to the last nearly without anyone else. Be that as it may, when the major event showed up, Oliver stifled and cost his group the option to come out on top for its fourth World Cup championship. Past the hour of the game, Rivaldo sent a non-strong shot that Khan extraordinarily couldn't deal with, Ronaldo Nazario was there to get the bounce back and gotten the ball to give Brazil a lead they won't ever lose. That day Germany lost by 2-0 after Ronaldo scored a sub subsequent objective, however Kahn didn't have anything to do against that on. 7. Harold Schumacher vs. Argentina, 1986 FIFA World Cup Harold Schumacher was perhaps the best goalkeeper of his age, however he likewise had a sketchy standing, so it's anything but a shock assuming everyone was blissful when he committed exorbitant errors that permitted Argentina to win its subsequent World Cup in history. To begin with, Argentina started to lead the pack when Schumacher missed a free kick from the right, permitting José Luis Brown to head home. Later on, the Teutons were drawing the game 2-2, when Schumacher again neglected to attempt to safeguard his objective, he didn't go about as quick as the need should arise and Jorge Baruchiga got the champ following Diego Maradona's pass. 6. Carlos Truco and Claudio Tafferel, 1997 Copa America these two offer a similar spot since they accomplished something unimaginable and that is having botches in a similar game. Argentinian conceived Bolivian goaltender Carlos Truco and Brazilian Claudio Tafferel cla clashed during the 1997 Copa America last, facilitated in Bolivia, 
leaving fans two of the most terrible blunders made in finals of all time. To begin with, Truco couldn't deal with a free kick by Roberto Carlos, where Edmundo made use and scored the primary objective of the match. Later on, Tafferel would go to accomplish something almost identical by not having the option to control Erwin Sanchez's shot that didn't look excessively risky. Eventually, the green and yellow dominated the match on account of a 3-1 result, yet the greatest feature of the match were these two manager. 5. David Seaman vs. Genuine Zaragoza, 1995 UEFA Cup Winners' Cup David Seaman is a complete legend in Arsenal. However, the Englishman, Englishman submitted genuine slip-ups all through his profession, costing a few opportunities to prevail to his groups. It's presently recognized as probably the greatest bungle in World Cup the objective seaman gifted Ronaldinho during the 2002 competition. Nonetheless, we're discussing finals here and that didn't occur in those examples. The explanation we're discussing seaman here is his cooperation in the 1995 UEFA Cup Winners' Cup when Arsenal was taking on Real Zaragoza. A hard-battled match among English and Spaniards was chosen by a midway line objective from previous Tottenham player Naam, who made his effort and cruised it over Seaman's head as of now of extra time. Zaragoza dominated the match 2-1 at Parc de Prince, making one of the most stunning crossroads throughout the entire existence of the outdated competition. 4. Moser Barbosa Nascimento vs. Uruguay, 1950 FIFA World Cup This person has gotten a ton of analysis and disdain since the time that scandalous game that saw Brazil lost the opportunity to win its first World Cup prize ever. The Maracanazzo is as yet viewed as one of the most mind-boggling accomplishments in football history, yet certain individuals guarantee Uruguay had some kind of help from Brazilian attendant Moser Barbosa Nascimento. Barbosa was as of late casted a ballot as the best goalie of the 1950 FIFA World Cup and truly outstanding of his ages. In any case, a straightforward error made become one of the most loathed players in the Little Canaries set of experience. Brazil just required an attract to win the World Cup, and they were doing precisely that before Uruguay. However, when the clock was ticking and Brazil was drawing nearer to lift the prize, Alcides Gigia go through the right flank of the pitch and when he was almost Barbosa's region, the goalie thought he planned to make a cross, yet shot low to towards the close to post all things considered, beating Barbosa and giving Uruguay the 2-1 triumph that made the Sky Blue world champions for the second time ever. 3. Luis Arcanada vs. France, 1984 UEFA Euro Luis Arcanada had a glorious profession at a club and global level and in some cases it's unjustifiable he's generally associated with this objective he let slip when Spain was taking on France during the 1,984 euro last. French legend Michel Platini took a free kick that didn't look excessively perilous, it was a smooth shot more than anything. Arcanada effectively got it in any case, however when individuals thought the play was finished, the ball sneaked off his mind and went through the net. That was the principal objective of the two France scored that day to win the Euro Cup. 2. William Schroch vs. Brazil, 1962 FIFA World Cup Schroch experienced a destiny like a few players in our rundown since he had an almost ideal competition for his Czechoslovakia. The group figured out how to qualify a large number of rounds until the last when they confronted Brazil in a conflict of titans. William concocted two missteps that made his side lost the 1-0 benefit they had and the opportunity to become world champions. To begin with, he left his close to post open, passing on the way clear for Amarildo to level. Afterward, with Brazil winning by 2-1, Schroj powerfully miscounted a high ball into the case and Vava didn't botch the opportunity from a couple of yards out. 1. Loris Carius vs. Real Madrid, 2017-18 UEFA Champions League This is the latest instance of these kinds of missteps, and likely the greatest reference of managers' mistakes in finals. R right around a year prior, Liverpool and Real Madrid arrived in Kiev to play the Champions League last, a few players were set to sparkle and take their particular crews to the top. At the end of the day it was Loris Carius who got everyone's attention. The German goalie was liable for the first and third objective Los Blancos scored, first, 
he expected to pass the ball to his partners with his hands and, surprisingly, realizing Karim Benzema was standing directly before him, he chose to release the ball and the cat just needed to mediate his leg to push the ball to the net. Afterward, when the game was finishing, a shot by Gareth Bale looked truly reasonable for Carius, however he baffled and unquestionably let the ball go to put the distinct scoreboard. Madrid won by 3-1 and Carius had one of the most horrendously terrible evenings of his life.